Hey guys, how's it going? Um, hope everyone's doing all right at their houses and if you're at work, things like that, just make sure to stay safe and just make sure to take a shower, make sure to get everything clean because I know the situation's getting crazier each day but unless we allow it to, unless, unless we make it better, we have to be, you have to make, you have, if you want to be part of the solution, you have to follow the steps. I know there's people still and everything's getting crazier and crazier. It's just like insane. But there's something I've learned. You can be part of the problem or you can be part of the solution. Which one, even though scientists and everyone's trying to do their part, but it's important that we do our part as well. And it's tough with the situation with COVID-19 and sometimes we miss our offices, we miss our jobs, we miss our lives. But then I know there's going to be times where we're going to lose our mind, we're going to cry and have a lot of emotional meltdowns and things like that. But hey, if you need me for anything, I'm always here for you and we're, we'll get through this together. I know it's a tough process that we're going through, but but we'll definitely do it together. I think, sorry if I haven't been recording any videos, but... I said, you know what, I'm going to just call myself the Drama King. Nothing involved with drama channels, but like, you know, something that I like to get involved in, which is dramas, but not, but Chinese dramas, Korean dramas, telenovelas, the type of dramas I like. But anyway, oh, sorry, my phone almost slipped back, but, but anyway, there's a drama that I f was able to finish, which is Ford Forever, Russia Tongxin, which is played by Zi Tao or Huang, or Huang Zi Tao and Jackson Yi Yang Chen Shi. Chen Shi. Excuse me, my Mandarin's not that great, but anyway. And it's based on a BL novel, which is Xin Qing Yan Zhi Yan Shifan or Yan Shifan itself. And even though they made some changes, added a new character, things like added female characters. A female character things like that but but because of the whole BL thing in China things like that which it's a long story but because of censorship which I don't think there should be any excuse at all because I believe everyone there should be dramas for everyone even for even for, for everyone and everyone should be treated equally but anyway it's a whole nother topic but it's based on two characters one of the, the one of them is is Chong Li Ming who is one, who is a prince and then he's also part of the organization called Yan Shi Fan and there he meets a young guy young kid named A Yi and both of them encounter a lot of journeys together and meet a lot of friends a lot of enemies here and there in which the drama takes place at the end of Qing Dynasty and the beginning of the Republic and there they meet up with a princess called Yu Chi, which is played by Hu Bingqing. And they're able to at least have a really, have a pretty good cast. Even if you don't know them, things like that. And even though, hey, they're new and things like that. The good thing is it's a 7.5 on Douban, which is kind of like the IMDb of China. But there's going to be a lot that happens. And some characters that are just like, no, no. And there's going to be a lot of things I'm going to spoil and... And I hope you guys can handle it. But anyway, it's a 50, 58 episode drama. And at the end, though, at least just wait for the ending, though. That's all I can say. But what's really interesting is how two people can meet and be friends. But also have a chance to also share values, things. And lots of experiences go along their way. And a lot of moments will be tested and... There's going to be romances here and there. But at the end of the day, though, I really enjoyed it, though. The only problem, though, it's that it's a very long drama. So if you have a, if you have something, if you have a strong stomach, then, hey, then you're in for the ride. But at the end of the day, though, it's all worth it, though. And, of course, it's not the most perfect production out there. Things like that. But what I real, but you can find it on YouTube. And I also recommend a website, though. Which you can also watch dramas. It's called maplestage.com. And I'm not sponsored by anyone here and there. But this is something I feel like everyone can 
enjoy and just watch dramas, both K dramas, Taiwan dramas, J dramas, even our Ch our beloved Chinese dramas. Which one I definitely recommend if you don't want to wait on YouTube for several days or or deal with that advertisement from Yoku or Aichi. But I definitely recommend it though and though anyway anyway though what I like though is not is both the costumes the hairstyles and yeah but if you kind of read the if you read the no but if you have read the novel things like that then it's understandable but at the end though I really liked it I really liked both the costumes which which I really liked and everything for towards it and at the end though I really I, I liked it I liked it though it's not perfect or anything like that but hey I can de it's definitely something that you should just give it a try if you're fans of the untamed and many of and if you're and if you're currently watching Winter Begonia I will do a an opinion on it and and I really am liking it so far far and I'm gonna see if I can pop out more videos whenever I can and hey definitely and hey if you want you can just check out my channel I have already have two videos posted posted where I I try to also talk about different subjects here and there here and there but like I'm still new to this so I'm still learning and hey gonna just click subscribe subscribe and then just remember to hit like and if you have any comments questions or concerns you can always ask me anytime thank you thank you and have a wonderful night